In this video, we will install MySQL 5.7 on an Oracle Linux 7 server. The installation instruction available in serverok.in. You can find the link in the description. I am logged into Oracle Linux server. Let's check the version of the OS. Cat etc star release. We are using Oracle Linux 7. Let's go back to the instructions. First of all, we need to check the repositories. For that, run the command yum repo list all. This command will list all repositories available. Here you can see we have MySQL 5.5, 5.6 and 5.7 repositories. These are disabled. We have MySQL 8 repository enabled. To see all the MySQL related repositories, we can use grep -i MySQL. We have these three MySQL 8 related repositories enabled. First of all, we will disable these repositories. For that, use the command yum config manager minus minus disable. Then you need to provide the repository names. What we need to do is disable these three repositories. Then enable the 5.7 repository. This should be enabled. To enable the and disabled repository, you have to, you can use the command yum config manager for it is provided by the package yum utils. So let us install yum utils first. Yum install minus y yum utils. Next, we need to disable these three repositories for that run yum hyphen config manager disable name of the repository. You can specify multiple repositories. Now the three MySQL 8 repositories are disabled. Let us verify with the command yum repo list all grep grep minus i MySQL. We have all the repositories disabled. If you search for MySQL, we don't have the MySQL community server. Next, we need to enable the MySQL 5.7 repository. This is the repository we need to enable. Currently, it is disabled. For that, run the command yum config manager hyphen hyphen enable. Then the repository name. Now the MySQL 5.7 server will be available. Let's verify with the yum search MySQL community server. We have MySQL community server package available. To find more information on this package, you can use the command yum info. It is provided by repository MySQL 57. So let's install the MySQL community server. Yum install, then MySQL community hyphen server. We got some dependency error. This is because we have some MySQL 8 related package pre-installed on this server. Let's find the packages we have installed rpm minus QA grep MySQL. We have these four packages. These are dependencies for Postfix mail server. If you remove these MySQL packages with the yum remove command, it will also remove the Postfix mail server. If you are not using Postfix mail server, then you can use the yum remove command to remove these packages. We will use the command rpm minus e minus minus no dps to remove the packages without deleting the postfix mail server. We need to remove this package, this one and the last package. This MySQL release package, we need this one as this is the one providing this MySQL repository. So let's remove the four packages. All the four packages are gone. We can verify with rpm minus qa grep mysql. It should only show the mysql release package. At this stage, we can install the mysql server with command yum install mysql hyphen community server. Paste the command. It asks for confirmation. Press y to install the packages. mysql 5.7 is now installed. Let's start the mysql server with the command system ctl enable mysql d hyphen hyphen now to verify mysql is running you can use the command psaux grep mysql here we have the mysql daemon running 
to find the temporary mysql password you can use this command this is the temporary mysql root password we need to change this before we can start using the mysql so let's change the mysql password this can be done two ways the method one is just to log into mysql then use this command to change the mysql root password you can specify the new root password here or you can just run this command mysql secure installation let's use the first option copy the command and paste it next you need to log in with this temporary password now you are in mysql command prompt let's change the mysql root password with the command alter user copy the command paste it now you need to replace this with a new secure mysql password paste the password here and press enter now exit the mysql command prompt using qt command now let's log in back with the command mysql minus u root then minus p press enter it will ask for password this is our new mysql password copy it and paste it to see all the database you can use the command show databases to see the mysql version select version another way is to use mysql hyphen hyphen version if you want to secure the mysql installation it will remove the remote user and any temporary database we don't have any temporary database here if you have something that will be removed like uh, some installation will have a database called a test that will be removed for that run mysql secure installation it will ask for the mysql root password it also provide an option to change the mysql root password in this case we are not going to change the password so press no if you want to remove anonymous users press y disallow root remote login press y remove test database and access to it we don't have a test database anyway press y for removing it reload privileges press y that's all we need to do to install mysql 5.7 on oracle linux 7 and secure it thank you for watching hope you find the video useful if you like the video please subscribe for more videos like this